everybody, welcome to the PokeFam. Today we'll be talking about trainer cards. So first off, I would think that we would want to start off with a supporter. You'll see these quite often. And so Lily is one that's in standard and she's pretty good. So basically for a supporter, you can only play one per turn. And um, so it's the same with the number stuff down here as for the Pokemon. So let's not mess with that today. And so, right here, it does tell you that you may only play one supporter card per turn. And so, you just do whatever the card says. So, Lily, in particular, says, draw cards until you have six cards in your hand. If it's your first turn, draw cards until you have a cards in your hand. And then, so, yeah. You can only play one per turn, and that's very important to remember. So, next up, we have stadiums. Um... These, you can only have one card per turn, and, um, in play per turn, and so, you also do whatever it says, and so, this one is pretty enforced, it says stadium up there, and this is a one that's used quite often too, it says once during each player's turn, that player may discard a card from their hand, if they do, that player searches their deck for a basic energy card, who reveals it and puts it into their hand. Then she'll bolster their deck. And the cool thing is that even if you didn't put it in play, you can still use it. Unless the card says otherwise. And so, next we're going to move on to item cards. So, you'll see item cards pretty often too. Um, it says item up here. And so, you may play as many item cards as you like during your turn. So you can, like, if your whole hand's item cards, just play them all if you want. So, yeah. But you may not want to do that. You may want to save some for later, but still. You could if you really wanted to. So this is Pokemon Communication. You do whatever it says. Reveal a Pokemon from your hand and put it into your deck. If you do, search your deck for a Pokemon. Reveal it and put it into your hand. Then show for your deck. So technically, you could take the same Pokemon you have in your hand, put it on the deck, and then take it back out again if you're just trying to clear out your deck and stuff. So that, so you'll see Pokemon communication pretty often too. So let's head on to another type of item. Um, they are, these are tool cards. You can only have one tool card attached onto a Pokemon unless said otherwise because there are certain pokemon that say you can have more than one on here this is a skateboard up here says item but it down here how you can tell it's a tool card is it says pokemon tool and so yeah so a skateboard says the retreat cost of the pokemon this card is attached to is one colorless less and it can retreat even if it's asleep or paralyzed now that can be super good there's this pokemon named jirachi um it only has a retreat cost of one and it has this attack i mean ability named called stellar wish um it makes it fall asleep and you can get a trainer card from the top five cards of your deck and so attach this on retreat it because Normally you can't retreat without with it being asleep, but you can with the skateboard. So you'll see these pretty off. And the po and it's also important to know that the tool cards directly affect the Pokemon is attached to and no one else unless the card says otherwise. Okay, so next is the um special energy. These technically aren't trainer cards. But they aren't exactly normal energy either, so he thought we would put it in. Um, so this one's draw energy. It's a special energy right there. And this one's simple. This, book, this card provides colorless energy. When you attach this Pokemon from your hand onto a Pokemon, draw a card. Pretty simple. But it follows the same rules as energy. You can only attach one per turn. And that includes all energy, even the special energy. So, that's it for right now, guys. Um, I hope this video was helpful. Make sure to like and subscribe. And after you subscribe, the little bell appears. And you click it so you can never miss another video. And so... Comment down below if this has helped you or any of our videos has helped you. And so see you next time on the PokeFam.
Bye bye.